We begin with breaking news. The Vatican says the Pope has accepted the retirement of Cardinal Marc Ouellette, former Archbishop of Quebec. At 78, Ouellette was past the normal age of retirement. He has recently been embroiled in allegations of sexual misconduct dating back to his time as Archbishop of Quebec, allegations he denies. The Vatican shelled the case against him, saying there were insufficient grounds to continue. Joining me now is CBC's Megan Williams in Rome. Megan, what more can you tell us about this announcement? Well, Natalie, as you say, Mark Willett was 78 years old. He was three years past the age of retirement. And in certain cases, the Pope asked powerful bishops or cardinals who he thinks uh, are competent to stay on. And Mark Willett was in that category. I mean, this was a very powerful cardinal and not just Canadian cardinal. He was the head of the Congregation of Bishops here in Rome uh, for for more than 12 years, that position, he was able to choose, uh, uh, very heavily influenced the choice of bishops around the world. He was also considered a papabile, meaning he was a papal contender in the two most recent conclaves. So um, in, in one sense, uh, this is a surprise because, as, as I said, he's a very powerful cardinal. In another sense, it's not. He's been face, facing these allegations of uh, sexual misconduct, which, as you mentioned, he has denied. These uh, date back to when he was the Archbishop of Quebec from the early 2000s to about 2010, before he be, came to Rome to head the Congregation of Bishops. Now, um, the Pope uh, did launch uh, an, an investigation last summer uh, it was fraught with conflict of interest. As a number of people pointed out, the person who investigated Willette was somebody who actually knew him. He was somebody who hadn't done that kind of investigation before. Nonetheless, Pope Francis felt that the allegations against him weren't strong enough and dismissed the accusations. Of course, it's now in the hands of the justice system in Quebec to decide, as part of this class action suit, whether or not uh, Mark Willett is guilty of these allegations. Thank you, Megan. The CBC's Megan Williams in Rome.